Hey, Dimitri. Uh, thank you so much for doing a version of the wings for Dr. Bosky. Um, that's what we're going to talk about today. So um, I don't have a ton of feedback. Uh, and I think, let me just hop on over here. So um, one of the things that I think we can do here, and you'll see it here, so I think we can probably, um, we can uh, essentially widen these wings just a little bit, you know, maybe uh, mostly, uh, I mean, not much, maybe something like, like this. Um, so I, I silhouette wise, it feel, it doesn't feel too bad. So, um, you know, maybe something, maybe something more like this, uh, actually not there. So maybe something like, like that. Um, just the, kind of open them up just a tiny bit. Uh, other than that, let me just hop over and, um, you know, so uh, a few caveats here. Uh, one is that, um, so we're experimenting with a smaller DBK in this case, because it's the, I, I basically scaled down the texture size. Um, here, one second. Um, and turn on the sound here. All right. Uh, shoot. Well, let me see how loud that is. Yeah, that's a. Uh, that's a little loud. But I, I want a little sound when I do this. A little bit of playthrough for you here. Uh, let's see here. Let's just kick that down to twenty. Okay. So, uh, yeah, so yeah. Um, we're gonna go the. I think so. There's two. There's a couple things. So one is that having the separate wings because of the way the particle system works in the engine. Um, I can't guarantee that when we are maxing out particles, that the particles that would draw the wings, even with uh, the um, weak spot, are going to be drawn. Sometimes they have to wait until particles die in order to draw them. So that's a bit fiddly. Um, we want the smaller DBK here. The uh, Don't worry about the weapon portals. Uh, the weapon portals need to be adjusted. Uh, I got to make a lot of changes based on this. But most importantly, right, like, here we go. Like, you can get a sense for the wings. I think the wing spot, the weak spot, can stay the same. Check out the giant gun here; it's so good. <laughs> it makes me feel pretty good there. Um, yeah, so I think the individual flapping side of the wings is not going to work. Um, just given the way the limitations we have in tech. Extra ship, but feels pretty good. Let me see my Loki's. Ship mm -hmm. I also like that at this size DBK, I still might increase the size a little bit, um, but it feels like the world is more dangerous. Like all the enemies are bigger, obviously. And so I'm still getting a feel for it um, and how it's going to, to really feel. You know, I've only played with it a little bit. Um, like I said, we can all we can bump the um, scale factor of Dr. Bosky up by another 20, 25%, maybe even more, and it would be totally fine. So. Um, for reference, I'm using the sprite sheet. I'm using 50%. There we go. And I thought I would just play through a little bit and give you a sense of what we got. So you can see there, right, like the, the glowing, uh, the weak spot is now missing because of all the particles. So I gotta work to see how I can do that. I might have to just increase the amount of particles that uh, that draw for the weak spot. So but that, we'll, we'll figure that out. At some point, um, hopefully in the engine, I can have a little bit more control over it. Monster I'm gonna talk with the, the engine developer on that. And uh, of course, the um, the uh, all the effects and everything need to be adjusted, right? So don't sweat it about that. This is mostly just. I mean, look how look how freaking beefy I can just get in his mouth. <laughs> it's uh, so silly. It's so silly, in a good way. Yeah. So I thought I would just uh, shut off a little bit here. See what we got. We've gotten some feedback from playtesting that some people felt like DBK could be a little bit smaller. You know, and some people have also talked to me now that the weapons are separate from the form. Oops, I missed that. 
uh, are separate from the form, uh, since they're not tied to weapon points. Uh, basically, you know, we're uh, also some early feedback we gotten from some people was that uh, in shmups, one of the things that makes you feel like you're one, you know, like a solo hero against the world is that you're small and the world is giant. Like the enemies are big, you know. So, um, and I, one of the things I, I was with the starship I really liked was I wanted the starship to to feel beefier. But now that we can uh, adjust the weapons any way we like, right, the weapon positions, I've got beefy weapons, and now it feels like he's conjuring forward, like, you know, like these, these really cool, like, you know, stronger, you know, one, one hero against, you know, all odds kind of feeling. Dude, I'm just, I'm getting totally lost playing here, so playing it gets me. So yeah, so this is it. Uh, like I said, we'll, we'll play with it a little bit more. We don't have to worry about the separate wings for now. Um, that was the only minor feedback on the wing positions themselves. Um, I, I scaled down the texture sheet by half um, for in-engine. We continue to work at the sizes that we're working at, in just case we always want to be bigger. Um, what I'm going to do is the uh, the portals. I'm going to adjust. Um, this portal is going to be more right here. The bottom weapon portal will be lower. They're still going to have the same spacing from each other because that has gameplay implications. Um, and then I'll probably, because DBK is smaller as well, I'll bring the uh, the back portal in a little bit more. So for the mid weapon, um, and I think that'll feel pretty good there. Um, other than that, um, yeah, I I think I think we're there. So I need I owe you a bunch of other things, you know. Um, but yeah, check out DBK and the size the size against these the uh, the uh, Hellmaster legions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I owe you some feedback on the final line, uh, line whining, final uh, lining, uh, lining. Jeez, I'm I'm tired. The final lining um, before we go into rendering. Uh, I already gave you feedback on the wings, of course, and um, yeah, so I'm I'm feeling pretty good about where we're at, um, and uh, I'll talk to you soon. Thank you very much.